Pathway to Excellence is an American programme that helps leaders to create the very best practice environments for nurses, midwives, AHPs and other clinical colleagues to practice in so that patients ultimately get the very best care. We'll be doing this across all of our sites, so across Newark, Kingsmill and Mansfield Community Hospital and we'll be learning um, from colleagues at Nottingham University Hospitals who were designated last year. Quality initiatives in Pathway to Excellence organisations are developed through interprofessional collaboration and benchmarking. The organisation-wide quality initiatives are evidence-based and focused on improving patient and population health outcomes. These initiatives include developing and revising patient care standards and policies, as well as staff education. Interprofessional teams within Pathway organisations create a culture of person and family-centred care and are driven by strong missions, visions, goals and values. In terms of Pathway to Excellence, it's about evidencing the great care that we give to our patients, the high quality experience, the safety that we give to our patients, but not just our patients, our staff as well. Evidencing the quality pillar is also about evidencing how we share best practice between each other, how we communicate in order that the really good stuff that we're doing gets shared and when things go wrong that gets shared as well so that we can give the best we possibly can for our patients, our visitors and our staff. Slade was a young man with autism who um, required our services to have a procedure and a general anaesthetic. He'd had really bad experiences in the past with healthcare, which meant his behaviour was challenging and it was difficult for staff to deliver care to him. So this required a lot of forward planning some really good communication between all the teams involved and his family as well. And it resulted in him being able to come in and have a really great experience. He was happy, he was calm, he had his procedure. And the family afterwards were just overwhelmed, overjoyed with the care that he'd received um, and said it was the best experience they'd had. So that's a really good example of person-centred care and the sort of thing that we do daily at this trust. Everybody will have their own examples of what they're doing within their own teams, their own departments, how they work with each other and how we really care for the people, both each other and our patients and their families. I would encourage everybody to recognise when that's happening and to contact either myself as the lead for the quality pillar or the Pathway to Excellence team with the fabulous examples which I know that you've got to share with us.